Sun roofs exploding with no warning. We've learned of thousands of incidents that were reported to federal regulators. And Channel 2 consumer investigator Justin Gray live in Northeast Atlanta. Justin, regulators have now closed their investigation into these explosions. Yeah, Linda, those federal officials say there's no evidence of serious injuries, but people who are behind the wheel when this happens say it feels and sounds like an explosion, and auto safety experts say, well, that could lead to a distracted driving crash. I just stood up on the rail, got up, and saw the big hole. Kate Holder says she had to pull over after hearing what she can only describe as an explosion while driving her brand new Jeep Wagoneer to work. Going 55 miles an hour and all of a sudden, like literally an explosion. Truly mm -hmm. spontaneous. Yes, the most bizarre thing ever. But when Channel 2 Action News checked with federal regulators, we found spontaneous breakage of panoramic sunroofs has been happening with a variety of makes and model vehicles for years. So much so that the National Highway Traffic Safety Administration NHTSA launched a seven-year investigation, finding, quote, spontaneous sunroof glass shattering is not an uncommon occurrence. More than 4,000 complaints of such occurrences were reported by 13 manufacturers. We checked the NHTSA complaint database, and as recently as last week, the driver of a Ford Edge wrote in, quote, I was driving down the road when out of nowhere my sunroof started raining glass in the inside of my car. There was no crack or stone that hit it, nothing. Michael Brooks is the executive director of the Center for Auto Safety. That type of distraction while you're driving, you know, you've got tempered glass chunks all over you and you don't know what just happened. I think any reasonable person can see that that could pose a, a pretty serious distraction risk. But in 2021, NHTSA closed its investigation into panoramic sunroofs without ever determining what's causing them to spontaneously explode, writing it, quote, has not identified sufficient evidence of a safety-related defect in the subject's sunroof. What if the glass got into my baby's, you know, eyes or face or even the car seat? Kate Holder says she's just thankful she had the cover closed on the sunroof. Now I don't want to open up, you know, the sunroof just in case. NHTSA says there have been about a dozen injuries, most minor caused from cleaning up the glass. Now we check back with NHTSA today to see if there are any updates. They tell us that there is no active investigation into these sunroof explosions. Reporting live in Northeast Atlanta, Justin Gray, Channel 2 Action News.